Hey guys, so finally I am uploading some allied motion tutorials as many of you were requesting. Now in this video I will show you how you can add some flash effect and bounce effect in the gunshots also with some motion blur and this video will be divided into two parts. In the second part I will show you how to make this video. So first of all let's create a new project in allied motion and I will keep the frame rate 30 fps and the background color black now select create project now click on the plus icon to add your video in the second part I will show you how you can edit that video it will be coming very soon so here is our video now if you have a low-end device and the video is not showing properly here you can just do one thing go back click on that back icon and select this and turn on this option it will give a low quality preview so that your device doesn't lag now coming to the project now to add those effect stop on the first beat what I do is I play the music and instantly stop after hearing the first gunshot and after hearing the gunshot I stop the video and go a few frames back now after stopping the video at the gunshot select the video and select effects now select add effects and here in the color and light option you can find gamma and exposure so select that and add a keyframe here click on this icon to add those keyframes now go back few frames and add another keyframe here and after few frames add another keyframe so there will be total three keyframes one will be at the point where you want the flash effect and one will be a little before that and the third one will be a little after now come at the center one and increase the exposure and make sure while adding the keyframe you have selected the exposure option now you can increase the exposure however you want so as you can see we have got that flash effect really looking nice now similarly you have to add the flash effect to all the other gunshots so for that play the music again and stop on the second gunshot after getting the point where the gunshot is add a keyframe there and add a keyframe before and add the third keyframe a little far away like this now increase the exposure in the center one now I will not show the others because it will be boring you know how to do that I'll just fast forward the video here after adding those flash effect now let's add the bounce effect it is very simple so for that you have to click on this move and transform option and select this icon here now if you look closely you can see those keyframes which you have added earlier you have to just add keyframes over those keyframes now go to that center keyframe and zoom in the video by dragging this slider it is very similar to that flash effect but in this case you are just adding the zoom effect in the center keyframe instead of increasing the exposure now add the bounce effect to all those other parts of the video now let's add some motion blur and this is the simplest thing in this tutorial so for that select the video and select effects now select add effect and you can find here blur option select that and select motion blur and that's all you don't have to do anything else it will add motion blur automatically and you can increase the motion blur by using this 
tune option if you want so that's all for this video guys thanks for watching see you in the next one